Hello, Jason here from septictank.co.uk and in today's video I'm going to be answering this question which is, which is the best septic tank? So, which is the best septic tank? How many different kinds of septic tanks are there? Well, let me show you. So if you go on to Google and you type in septic tank, so let me just do this, right? You'll just get hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and thousands of different septic tanks, right? And all the manufacturers will be telling you that theirs is the best and everyone else's is rubbish. But the point is, is this. There's two types of septic tanks on the market today. That is an onion tank and a bullet shape septic tank or um, a low profile shallow tank is, is what they're also known as. So what do I mean by an onion tank and a bullet tank? Well, let me show you. So if we get this back up now. All right, so this is a typical onion shape septic tank. They're big and they're bulbous, all right? And they're made of fiberglass. Here's some more examples. There's a small onion septic tank, but you can see <laughs> it's uh, that guy there is about six foot tall. So these are big tanks. But anyway, the point is, this is what these onion tanks and look, look like. Come in all different makes and sizes and different brands. And there's another one there you can see down the hole. And here is um, a bullet shaped septic tank. Why do they call them a bullet shaped septic tank? Because they look like a bullet. And, um, and there you go, there's one in the flesh there. So which is best, an onion shaped septic tank or a bullet shaped septic tank? But why are they the best? Is it just my personal opinion? Well, let's get straight into this and let me show you. All right, so here we've got two holes. Well, one hole, sorry. <laughs> I was never very good at maths at school. So there we've got a hole. So let me put an onion tank into the hole here. There we go. So that's typically what an onion shaped septic tank looks like. All right, so if I bring it down to here. All right, so they are typically white in color. The inlet pipe and the outlet pipe are about a meter, meter and a half below the grass. And um, they come with a lid, which you can put on the top like that. Okay, and so you dig the hole and you put the tank in. So what are the pros and the cons of the onion shape septic tanks? Well, let me show you. The pros are they're slightly cheaper to buy. All right, so typically they can be anywhere from 100 to three or 400 quid cheaper to buy than a bullet shaped septic tank. So what about the cons? Well, there's quite a few cons, right? With an onion tank, you need to dig a very big hole. You need a very big digger to dig that hole, right? Which means you've got to spend more money out in hiring a bigger digger. You've got to use concrete, right? To, uh, 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 to install it with, you've got to put a concrete blanket around it. You've got to allow for a very deep soak away. The deeper the soak away, the bigger the soak away is. They're made of fiberglass, so they can puncture easily and they can crack easily. Um, if you're not careful, they can pop up out the ground, so you put them in the hole. If it rains overnight or there's a bit of water uh, or moisture there, they can easily just pop up to the ground and they need an anchoring. So let me show you what I mean by all these cons, right? So by no way am I demonizing the onion shaped septic tank. I'm just showing you, if you're gonna install one of these, the realities of what else that you need. All right, so there's your onion tank. So as I said, you need a bigger digger. Then when you've done that, you need to put an anchor around it. Now that generally consists of um, like um, two straps and like a concrete lintel. Because what happens when you dig the hole and you put it in, if it rains overnight, they'll just pop up to the surface. They're just like, uh, just like trying to put a balloon you know, keep a balloon down in the water that's blown up. It just won't stay down because of the air inside it. It just pops up. So once you've anchored it in and you then have to concrete it. So if I show you the concrete, there you go. So typically that is what a concrete blanket looks when you've put it around the onion shaped septic tank. The reason you have to do that is because 
once you've buried them, even if you've co cover them, surround them in soil and shingle, they're still notorious for popping up out the ground, especially once you've got them empty. So let me just put the tank back on. Uh, what am I trying to do here? Okay, let me just take this off. There you go, that's what I'm trying to show you. All right, so that's what um, a, a cross section of it will look like once it's been concreted in. So that's the onion shaped septic tank. So what about now the low profile bullet shaped septic tank? Are they worse? Are they better? What are the pros, what are the cons of a bullet shaped septic tank? Well, as we saw, they're slightly dearer to buy. So if you're going on the face value of looking at it's going to cost you up front. The bullet septic tanks will cost you two, three hundred quid more or a hundred quid more up front. That's a fact, right? But the pros far outweigh the pros of the onion tank. The pros of the low profile tank is that they're shallow, right? So they're really easy to install. The tanks aren't made of fiberglass, they're made from rotor molded plastic, so they're a lot thicker, they're a lot stronger. You don't need any concrete with them. Uh, so that will save you at least 800 or a thousand quid and you can also put a shallow soak away in with them So let me show you the compare now. Let me do a comparison with the um, Onion shaped septic tank to the bullet shaped septic tank So if I just move that to the side there, all right and keep that in view there you go So let me uh, dig the hole for the second one. So there you go So straight away you can see that the hole for the low profile one it's a lot, lot shallower, a lot easier to uh, dig. In fact, they take about 40 minutes to dig the hole for these um, uh, bullet-shaped septic tanks. So let me put the tank in the ground. There you go. That's basically the difference in size-wise. Now, these size-wise, now, these are two small tanks. All right? I've, as the tanks, these probably do, well, these will do one to two bedroom or one person to two people, these tanks. But obviously, the more people you're catering for and the bigger the bedrooms, the bigger the 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 low profile tank will just get a bit longer so it, it keeps it nice and shallow even still so there's the basic difference between the two tanks right so let me put concrete around that one okay so that's what that looks like with concrete on as i said on the bullet shaped septic tank all that you've got to do is put some shingle around it so the concrete so you've so you've bought your onion tank all right, and you've you, you, you've saved a couple hundred quid up front, but then you're gonna to have to, as I said, spend about five, six, seven, eight hundred quid on the concreting and the bigger digger. So all in all, typically, all right, the onion-shaped uh, septic tank will cost you about a thousand quid more to install than the bullet-shaped one. So although you save two hundred quid up front with the onion one, uh, by the time you finish installing it, the onion-shaped septic tanks cost you about 1,000, 1,500 quid more to put in than the bullet one. But there you go. So that's basically the difference between the two tanks. So with that in mind then, which is the best septic tank out of the two? Well, personally, I think it's a no-brainer. It's the bullet-shaped septic tank. I think that's best. Yes, you can call me biased if you want, but if you just looked at pure facts, data, right, uh, or, or budget and monetary wise, right, you're going to have a lot left money left over once you put the bullet shaped septic tank in than you have when you've put the onion shaped septic tank in. So why are the, there two different tanks on the market? Well, the onion shaped septic tank basically um, came about in the 80s early 80s and they're very popular um, and the low profile septic tanks didn't really come out until about five six years ago so the onion shaped septic tank was the only basically the only septic tank that you could buy but now it's been as i said superseded or preceded by the bullet shaped septic tank so there you go if you're looking for a septic tank then i heartily recommend right you definitely go for a, a bullet shaped septic tank so there you go let me just get rid of my other self here there we go so listen thank you very much for watching this video today if you'd like to see more free videos and get more free help and advice then just go to septictank.co.uk or you can go to my youtube channel septic tank tv if you subscribe to my septic tank tv channel you can be in with a chance to win a free bullet septic tank so listen thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video today you take care and i'll speak to you soon for more information just click the link below this video or visit septictank.co.uk for free help and advice